On the 25th of November, 1120, the son of England's King Henry I and the grandson of William the Conqueror was on board a small lifeboat fleeing a scene of maritime destruction. William, the heir to the English throne, had been sent to France as the honorary Duke of Normandy to pay homage to the French king. Instead of returning to England with his father, William decided to board Captain Thomas Fitzstephen's ship. William's party soon became drunk on French wine, and in their drunken revelry, the crew tried to beat Henry I's ship back to England. But as the white ship sped out of France, the vessel struck a submerged rock, and the ship began to sink into the freezing water. While the English heir was packed into a lifeboat in time, the terrified screams of his half-sister Matilda caused William to order the ship be turned around to rescue her. But as the dinghy approached, other crew members tried to scramble on board, and under the weight, the lifeboat sunk, killing everyone on board, including William. With no male heir left, Henry I implored his nobleman to pledge allegiance to his daughter, Matilda, whose attempted succession would eventually cause the country to collapse into civil war. 